Hello, friends. We are back again with more uh, Life is Strange. Uh, we moved on from the quad. Now we're at the dorms. Um, it's time for us to go find uh, the the flash drive. I need to go to my room oh, and return yes. Warren's flash drive. Yes, yes, exactly. Um, so, look at that. The Prescott Dormitory? Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm? Oh, well, no wonder the principal doesn't want to do anything about it. Still can't believe that. I mean, not can't believe it in the way that I don't think it ha would actually happen, but more like, hey, ugh, Logan just so Hodgson. annoying. All American asshole. Oh! Oh, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Whoa. Okay, all American asshole. Slogan the all American asshole. Throwing a football just like a freaking douche. All right. Who's this over here now? Zachary. Zachary always looks like he'd rather be throwing back a beer than a football. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Sweet. Sounds like a football, Max. Big football. Step away. Oh, I'll, okay. What happens if I get in the way? Ha! <laughs> Nothing. Can you imagine though? Let's see. Oh, <gasps> it's Kate. Okay. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. I feel like I should talk to her last. Um yeah, I'll talk to her. No, I'll talk to her right now. I'll talk to her right now. Kate. Kate. Hi. There's Kate, looking sadder than usual. I'm sorry. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. Uh, how was class? How did you like class today? I don't remember. I guess I don't care about much of anything today. Is there anything? Max, I'd like to be alone, if you don't mind. I'm sorry. <gasps> <sighs> Max, get a clue. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Hi, Kate. Hey, Max. You look down. You look down. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. Sorry to be a drama queen. Awesome. Is there anything... Max, I'd like to be alone. If you okay, don't so there's nothing I can do. I'm sorry. That's fine. That's fine. All right. Hey, Samuel. Good old Samuel. Some people are creeped out by him. And he's not creepy, just X-Files weird. <laughs> Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. Ooh, yeah, he does give me the creep vibes. What's with these posters? What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? Well, only she would know that, right? Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. Yeah. You can't color over that sunlight. Uh, you knew Rachel? You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint windows. Yeah, he's giving me some real creep vibes. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. Okay, what was she like? What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. Okay. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, I paint. Okay. Nice. Wow, yeah, I can see why people think he's kind of weird. Oh, here's the click. Um, I'm going to go over here and talk to a purple hair girl first. Alyssa. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you? How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. <laughs> I think you're better off <laughs> eating chiclet. Good point. Now if you'll excuse me. Okay. Sorry. I really have to find out what happens. All right then. You live your dreams. Ooh, what's this? Oh, Don't take it out on the tree, loser. Okay, Rachel owes me money. That's not good. Man. This Rachel chick has a lot going on. Glad to see our campus is eco-friendly. Yep, me too. So glad. Oh, look, it's a butterfly. 
You'd think with all the rain here in Oregon, you wouldn't need to water the lawn. Another butterfly, huh? I guess Blackwell has to keep the lawn and plants well manicured to look good on a catalog. All right. Oh, Hi, shit. Victoria. There's Victoria and her mean girls. Woof. Here oh, we go. It's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Oh, really now? What a lame gimmick. Such wit. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. <sighs> the Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> uh, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. That's fine, I can walk around you. Oh, wait. No. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. No. Why don't you go fuck your selfie? Whoa! Out of my way. Whoa! Okay. Keep walking, hippie. That's the first and last time I expect to hear that. There's a ladder. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Well, it probably has something to do with the sprinklers. Sprinkler. Okay, now where exactly is the sprinkler valve? Was it over here? Was this the sprinkler valve? I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Let's find that valve then. Is it in here? Okay. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to oh, use. Oh god, I feel like this is not going to be not going to go well for me. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. Yeah, it does. Huh. But it's not giving me an option to use it. So, That was pretty dramatic, the way. Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Yeah. Huh. Okay, okay. Figuring it out, slowly but surely. This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. None shall pass. Capiche? Huh. Damn, I missed something. Then what did I miss? Well. I must look like such an idiot right now, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm like, I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, I came over here for the sprinkler valve. Think, Max. Rewind and find something. Okay. There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Tamper! Samuel is way too close. Oh! Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. Ha ha! I'm I figuring it out, guys. Oh, I feel. <laughs> I feel okay, so let's dumb. See if this works. Man, I feel so dumb for not figuring that out sooner. I was so distracted by that butterfly. I was like. Not even paying attention to the bucket. Okay. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens here. I want to get far enough away that I don't get in trouble. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. Okay, wait. I think I know what I have to do. Okay. 
Okay, I'm going to tamper with the bucket. And then... Okay, let's see if this works. I'm gonna talk no to... Allowed. Victoria is not getting the hint. Oh, I've got to move the ladder. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. Okay, so if I tamper with this... Okay, let's see if this works. Okay, and then I'm going to maybe go over here and mess with the water. Will that help? This main sprinkler valve looks easy enough to use. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yes! Water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking Woo! outfit costs? You look we got great. this. I can't even chill on the steps. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, poor Samuel, though. This is really going to suck for him, isn't it? <sighs> no way. No fucking way. Yes. Oh, Samuel, is sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. <sighs> oh no. I'm going to get him in trouble. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Oh god, this action will have consequences. Aw, oh, Victoria. Hey. Sorry about that. Uh hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Oh Um Comfort her. Uh comfort her. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. Yeah. But there'll be another. Oh. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. <gasps> Look at me! I was nice! I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Aww. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck yourself. Oh my gosh, here. can we be friends? That was me. Can I but be friends? Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. Aww. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Yay! See? Oh. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. What is that? Welcome to Sluts Are Us? Oh, I don't have to walk up. Dang it. <laughs> oh my god. You know what, though? I... I want to be nice. <laughs> Oh man, I must be such a, um, I'm, I'm such a, like, easy mark, I guess. Let's see. Okay. That bitch stole my, uh, Fransu New Face Cream. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. Let's see. An intrusive surveillance system could be installed by the end of the school year at Blackwell Academy. Members of the fa faculty and student council will hold a public forum to inform and discuss this important issue. Please come speak out against this invasion of privacy. Well, I already signed your uh, your your petition, so I don't know what more you want from me. Pissed we took so long. You mean okay? Have fun, girls. The map. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. There's another map. Welcome to Black Hill. Black Hill. Oh, look at that. We all have our own rooms. That's nice. Oh, Kate has to live next to Victoria. Woof. All right. I, yeah. Okay. Okay. Slate. Red rum. Oh, my God. Room 217. No way in hell am I ever going in here. Ha. Just like from, um. Oh, my goodness. 
I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. <laughs> man, people here are merciless. Oh, man. See Kate's video for proof. Oh, my God. Poor Kate. I don't know what happened. Huh. The Shining. Sorry. That's what I was looking for. Stomp them, bitches. Bigfoot. Cheerleader at heart. Whoop. Sorry. Bigfoot. That was uh, definitely misread, this but also, woof. Popular. She's everywhere. Okay. Taylor is a slave. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Woof. Truly pathetic. Huh. As if. As if. Oh, no. Juliet, extreme reporter. Juliet, read this week's edition of the Blackwell Totem. Seriously, who cares? Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Okay, I'm I'm hearing something weird. Okay. What the hell? What's going on in there? Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. <laughs> At least that's an alarm from this century. Okay. Oh, nice same one. Nice atmospheric shot. I was trying to see if I could go into the bathroom. Dusting. Definitely cannot. Bored. <laughs> be alert on campus. Follow, follow, uh, observe the following tips for your safety. Always be aware of your location. Always let a friend know where you are or where you're going. Always report any incident immediately to the campus authorities. To download a free campus alert app, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Could be fun. Glad I'm not Aww. the only lonely nerd around here. Geek Girls Book Club! Uh! I would have loved that! Ha! No boy wizards or sad vampire fiction allowed. <laughs> ah, woof. But, oh, man. I would have loved this. Okay. Can't go in there. Good to know. I just like to be as thorough as I can. There's my room. We'll bang for Jesus. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. Aw, see, I want to be nice. Spread positivity. Oh, this action will have consequences. Okay. The universal symbol for please leave me alone, asshole. Oh, gosh. This is like the pop what have I done? Of our dorm. <laughs> okay, so we got don't let depression get you down. Yes. Lost phone. Statistics tutor wanted. Meat is still murder. <laughs> Oh, man. There's that. This one's my room, but I still want to look around. A poster. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? You're the boss. A and then there's just boobs. All right. Pie! Ha! Lauren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Aww. See, can't go in there. Slate, look. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Draw. Draw something. I should be a lot more nervous about how much I'm doing that'll have consequences. I'm kind of nervous about it. I'm nervous enough. Aw. Obvious but true. That's me. A mix. My teddy bear. My guitar. Ah, oh, sweet home. I love my cubes like that. Cube. Okay, so we got DVDs. One day I'll organize my film collection. <laughs> One day I'll get an actual HD TV. Back when I was in high school, I had a like a crap ton of DVDs, so I um I would always alphabetize them because I'm insane. <laughs> Max, your principal sent me an email saying that you told some tall tales about a Blackwell honor student. Is this true? The principal said. This was a serious false charge, and that he's worried you're telling stories. Call me ASAP so we can talk about this. Gosh darn it! I'm not telling stories. Okay. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. Oh. I haven't forgotten you, little Lisa. Yet. Water the plant. You are thirsty. 
I'm the worst baby mama. Oh my god. Drink up. I kill I kill all the plants I have. I love cactuses and stuff. Oh. This watering my plant will have consequences? Oh my god. Oh no. The winger and the cow instead of the catcher and the rye. <laughs> All right, my sticky note. It looks like Dana left me a little. Hey, picture. girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch some flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. D. All right. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Let's look at our photo my album. My source for instant photo inspiration. Let's see what I'm it is. Look at the core show, my man. Huh? I don't think I could take <gasps> my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Yeah, well, I can freeze time and reverse it. I'm trying to remember that song about that. There's my poor laptop begging me to check in. Let's use it. Daniel has so much talent. Aww. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. Aww. I am so addicted to this site. Camera Look porn! At these vintage beauties. Ah! Lauren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real Max, thanks today. for your cop email and copy of Jefferson's class notes. Now I shall never stop sending you messages of gratitude. I also have a rather eclectic collection of TV cult and classic and fucked up films on a fat flash drive if you ever want to check them out. Thanks again for the help. I'm a scientist more than an artist. Now, can you quickly explain to me how a camera works? Be seeing you. Warren G. Aww. And then she's got another email. Me and Ed. Thank you for ordering. <laughs> Too relatable. Too relatable. Okay, photos. Looks like me and my dad. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the space uh -huh. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Look how young I look. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont troll. Oh my god. Let's see, we got some art books. Cartier-Bresson, Doineau, Hamilton, the greatest. We got our hi-fi. I should go to the thrift store and pick up some dollar vinyl. Is that too hipster? <laughs> yes. I don't care. Music inspires me in my photography. And then we got a drawer. <sighs> Max Aww. and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Aww. Wait, wasn't the blue hair girl's name so Chloe as well? It. it makes me smile thinking of the day mom and I sewed that together. Let's see, my teddy bear. Ahoy, Captain. Aww. At least I know you've got my back. I have and a I stuffed penguin named Sir Poops a lot. parents rushed me to the ER. I knew we were bonded forever. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Power strip. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. Oh, I can take a photo. Oh, heck yeah. Ooh, achievement unlocked. Red eye. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. <gasps> He's such a goof. Aww. Ma to Max or whom it may concern, the cinematic contents of this flash drive are of a graphic, life-altering, controversial nature. This collection has been downloaded with the greatest care for the most discriminating viewer. I congratulate you on your taste and eagerly await your in-depth reviews of Cannibal Holocaust and Ultra Vixens. Peace, Warren G. Aww. All right, I'm gonna lay down. Hmm. Aww. <sighs> it feels so nice to just relax. This day has been so damn bizarre and it feels like it has gone on forever. Aww, poor girl. Maybe I'll just wake up now and find out I was dreaming all of this. Maybe. Like Poe said, a dream within a dream. Okay. Get on up. Time to keep going. Okay. I'm going to try turning off the power strip. Turn on. 
Okay. What else have we got around here? Look at this. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbird. Ha! <laughs> oh, we got a guitar. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Got cookies. I love that Mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. <laughs> and slipped in a two hundred dollar gift certificate. Oh heck yeah! She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Aww. Open up the drawer. I'm eighteen now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. <laughs> Happy birthday, Maxine. We will we'll never forget the day you were born and your first smile. It was love at first sight. It's your special day. We miss you, but we're so proud that you're following your dreams. We love you, your mother and father. All right. Wow, you do not have very many clothes. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. How I'm often do you have to do laundry? Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? No oh, selfie portraits. Let's see. Let's play the guitar. I want to see what it sounds like. How good are you, Max? Show me your stuff. I gots to know. <laughs> okay, we're done. All right, let's go get that flash drive from Dana. What do you say? What do you say? Oh wait, there's a book. I got it. I gotta see the book. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. And instant. I should film. have every Bradbury book for myself. Yes. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. Okay. But I can't help it. I'm analog, not digital. Let's see. Okay, the shoes. Okay, I think I've got everything. Great. Great. Let's leave. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Well. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. No, I'm doing it. This is so stupid. Answer, you wuss. Ugh. What's going on, dude? Juliet looks like she's ready to throw down. Hey, Juliet. You is everything to... cool? Oh, yeah. Yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. What what'd she do? What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Uh, oh crap. Here we go. Here we go. Patson? Juliet Pats... Juliet Patson. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Oh. Hey, Juliet. Oh yes, Max. Juliet Watson. So Juliet Watson, be nice. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, of course I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she you was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. There we go. Uh, would Dana do that? Would Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria? Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything. But I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. Okay. The proof is in her room, in Victoria's room. Okay, where's Victoria's room again? Oh god, guys. Victoria's room. Oh god, I'm gonna get in trouble. Be the change you wish to see? Oh, Victoria. Oh my god. A fucking break. Oof, I'm gonna get in so much trouble. I'm gonna get in so much trouble! Dior, Givenchy, you could pay for my tuition with that wardrobe. Oh my god. Those boots are made for walking runways. Oh my god, guys. That is a tasty plasma. Maybe I could <laughs> see spirits, spirits, spirits within. within. Oh my god. I don't care what anybody says. That's one of the best Oh, Max. Films ever made. You lost my respect. You lost my respect. I bet Victoria put Juliet on her shit list after this article.
Oh, man. One of Blackwell Academy's most durable and influential social groups, the Vortex Club, started in the neon 1980s as a new wave rebellion against the yuppie forces of the Reagan era. Imagine a time when computer nerds were dumped into garbage cans and blue hair was a cause for expulsion and even violence. Male students who wore earrings were bullied and beaten. Now every football player has two or three exotic piercings. So the Vortex Club was originally a haven from the peer pressure that every generation experiences. How ironic, then, that the revolutionary roots of social misfits has become what some students claim is an elitist cult. Or is this just envy at one of Blackwell's most successful organizations? We tried to interview Vortex Club member Victoria Chase, but she refused to comment and even tried to stop this story from publication. Oh my god. Well, woof. That gives me some, uh, oh, a missing persons poster. Victoria hates racism. Oh! How insecure. Woof. All right. Victoria is a real Jefferson groupie. Okay. Read. Okay. The leaflet. Oh my god. Even more groupiness. There's the laptop. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that adorable cup of coffee, though. Oh my god. That's... I... Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Okay. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. No. They should call this series aloof. Cold and soulless. Kind of like Victoria. I do love her room, though. It's really, really cute. <laughs> Her camera. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. I hate you, Victoria. Okay. Ouch. Well, at least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Oh no. Okay. Well, she got she got rejected from that. Photos. Speaking of selfies. Oh, I could mess them up. Whoa. I have no idea Victoria's parents Oof. own the Chase space. Color me impressed. I don't want to mess it up, though. I, I want to be nice. Yes, Victoria has the best retina screen laptop. But it's so tempting. Okay. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice shot. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Taylor, so sad to inform you that I totally, totally punked Juliet and Dana just now. All I had to do was mention to Juliet that I saw a nasty sext from Dana on Zach's phone. Dumbass believed me, so I expect there to be a dorm rampage soon. Juliet deserves this for slutting Zach away from me. As for Dana, who gives a shit? Get out your popcorn. Oh, God. Okay. Print. Wait, where did the print? Where's the printer? Where'd it go? Where is it? I did was not paying attention. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, that's so far away from the computer. Okay, take. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Okay. Ah, oh, I really want to mess up the photos, but I really shouldn't. Okay, um, nope, we're leaving. I didn't do it. I didn't do it, guys. I hope you're proud of me. I hope you're proud. I hope you're so proud of me. Okay. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's <gasps> see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Yay! We did it! We did it! Okay, um, let's go in and get the Almost flash done. drive. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Oh, look, it's another room. 
I love looking at all the rooms. It's so much fun. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess. I mean, like, like this isn't dramatic. <laughs> Dana takes her Blackwell spirit seriously. Oh God. That looks like a home pregnancy test. <gasps> I could take it. Ooh, Dana's Facebook wall is up and running. I shouldn't look. But I'm going to. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. So fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. Wait, read? Hey girl, thanks for the party favors. What up, Dana? Justin Couch locked with Super Mario. If you want to come over and we can blaze and play or go for a walk, let me know. I'll be here. Still here? Hello? Aww. Aww. Okay. Look. This is both sad and pathetic. Dana, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumbass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I passed out. If you need any money, let me know. Oh, no. Oh, poor girl. It would be a cool sticker without the words. What is it? Oh, enter the vortex. Dana really does look stressed about all this. Hey, What's Dana. What's up? Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria's not nice. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Yeah. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy shit. Films I've never even heard of. <laughs> and in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. Oh, guys, again, I'm so tempted. I could take it. Ah. Uh... But, oh, man, I could take it, and I'm wondering whether there's going to be a reason for me to have it later. The RPG player in me just wants to take all the items, obviously, so that I can, like, have options later. But, my God, I, sh I shouldn't. I really shouldn't. I really, really shouldn't. I'll take the Must flash drive. protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Max. Ah! Ugh! Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna get in trouble. I'm gonna get in trouble. Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. Oh! You're, You're just nosy. I think you better go. Oh no! I can rewind. I can rewind. I can rewind. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. Yeah. Hey, Dana. I heard a rumor about you. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? Of course. Of course. I was pregnant. Was. Oh, what about the other? That beat dad? You can catch him on the 40 yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Who then? Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. Woof. I assume Dana kept the appointment. Oh, man. That's so tough. Okay, let's let's get out of here. Oh. 
I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. The more I text, the longer I take on my way. Bye. Aww. All right. Let's get out of here. I think this is probably a good place for us to end it for today. I actually have no idea how long I've even been filming. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Oh, <laughs> Woof. Damn. I better rewind. Oh, man. Okay. Next time. Bye, guys.